You know, we all know that it's easy to fall into old habits, and it's sometimes hard to change them. But developing new habits can be easy if we talk about how we can reframe our questions. Reframing our questions is as simple as picking different ways of approaching the same problem. For example, and this uh, tip comes to you from a book by Marley Adams called Change Your Questions, Change Your Life. And wouldn't we all like to change our questions and change our lives? You can pick one of two paths when we talk about changing questions. The first path is called the learner path. The second path is called the judger path. So what I would suggest you do, and it's an interesting experiment, is listen to yourself when you ask questions. Are you judging or are you learning? Is it an open-ended question? Is it a closed-ended question? Do you ask yourself whether I will or do you tell yourself I won't? Picking your questions, reframing the questions so that you're a learner, not a judger, is going to change the outcome. And that'll help change your positivity, it'll help make you happier, and it'll help you from falling into the same old patterns that have really framed your life so far and allow you to open up to new possibilities, to new questions, to new paths of learning and to new answers. That's my coaching tip today. Thank you so much for joining me on Food Exposed. I hope you'll watch the show, share it with your friends, share it with your family, and ask them to share it with their friends and their family. And don't forget to join me again next week for another episode of Food Exposed. For more Food Exposed, check me out on empowerme.tv. And until next week, remember, Make food your best friend and exercise your companion for life.